two, two, three. Welcome. Please select an option. Channels or sizes or topics. Two, two, three. Please explore a topic. Two, two, three. Topics. Ticks. Please select a screen size. Mid-sized businesses are the engines of a smarter planet. IBM and our business partners work with a vast array of these leading companies, like an innovative pharmaceutical and specialty packaging company, an eco-conscious electricity company, and a forward-thinking freight transport company. Whether solving a problem or seizing an opportunity, you need the expertise, insights, and tools from IBM business partners to help turn your ideas into results. Let's build a smarter planet. Hey guys, Sam with Engadget, and we are looking at the Hot Wheels Video Racer. Uh, as you can see, this little Mattel uh, car here has a mini, mini, tiny LCD screen, and there's a camera right in the front. It's got two buttons and a record button on here. So let's put this bad boy on the track and see what we got. So we're gonna hit um, record. Is it recording? Wait till it turns red. Okay, so it's turned red, and let's place this on the track. Let it go. Oh. Alrighty, and now we're going to hit the uh, stop button. And turn it over and press play. Uh, there's obviously no audio because it doesn't have a speaker, but it definitely is playing. So you can place it on the track there. And then it's zooming down the track. Um, and with this toy, you can plug it into uh, the computer, Windows or Mac. It just mounts as a USB uh, flash drive. Uh, it's got 12 minutes of VGA recordable video uh, at 30 or 60 frames per second and uh, comes with video editing software. And uh, release date on the product? It's going to be this fall. This fall. Okay. Thank you very much. Normally, when you dive, you dive faster and faster. AT&T introduces a new Windows phone with beauty. Uh, after uh, arriving to about uh, 1,000 feet, it now was uh, relatively dark, and dive then dive gradually, as soon as we were continuing the dive, uh, the water was darker and darker, and when we arrived to approximately uh, 600 meters, which is about uh, 2,000 feet, it was uh, completely night. 
the latest Bluetooth headset we have is called the Jawbone Bluetooth headset. The average person has 28 first kisses. Here's the gun, far less of the time. Dentin Pure, it purifies your breath deliciously instead of just covering it up. Dentin Pure, practice safe breath. The interesting thing about the Alive Jawbone Air is it's also one of the first Bluetooth headsets to have an accelerometer. For example, when you wear the headset, you can tap the cover. Hi everybody, it's Tim from The Gadget, and I'm coming to you from the seat of a Yike bike. This is the first one that's been imported to the U.S., the first uh, full retail model. They're available for sale right now if you want one, price of about $3,500 and some change. For that you get a electric bicycle that looks like nothing you've ever seen before and I assure you that it'll look like nothing anybody else around you has ever seen before. And they will go to great pains to go and ask you what the heck that thing is that you're riding around. Especially when it's bright green like the one that we have is. Now the bike's got a top speed of about 15 miles an hour, a range of about 6 miles. But trust me when I say you'll be wanting to get off long before six miles have passed. It has a pretty traditional looking bicycle seat. Actually, in the world of a bike seat, it's a pretty cushy one. But unlike a normal bike, you can't put a lot of weight on your wrists. They really you can't put any weight on your wrists here. It's all on the seat. And, uh, well, it just gets a little uncomfortable after a while. We'll leave it at that. Overall, we think the Alien so I slow down with the Medellin and finally enter 35,000 feet with just a reasonably priced $130 the with door. all of the MyTalk applications involved and the new accelerometer technology as well. It also comes in very attractive packaging. I'm Nicole, this is Now you sure will get bored riding the thing, I can say that without doubt. It's uh, a lot of fun. However, it's a little tricky, as you can see. It actually comes with something that looks like a grenade pin stuck in the accelerator to keep you from going full throttle. The company recommends you spend about half half an hour with the pin in there before you pull it out and uh, unleash the full power of the bike. We found that it goes about 8 miles an hour with the pin in, and we talked it down at about 14 miles an hour with the pin out. And absolutely, you want to make sure that you spend half an hour with that pin in there, because trust me, this is a very different experience from your average bicycle, or your average motorcycle for that matter. Sure, you're going a lot slower, but you're basically sitting over the front tire, and the handlebars are down behind you. It's very different, very odd. And uh, if you put your weight too far forward, if you lean forward, it goes into kind of like a mini tank slapper. But you don't even have a tank to hold on to. You're just kind of out here feeling naked and exposed. If you do fall off, again, you're not going that fast, but it's still going to hurt. Who to please? Welcome. Please select an option, channels or sizes or topics.